Welcome to Joso. My name is Edwin and today I'll be showing you how to use the Comnav total station to carry out measurements on on angle and distance method. So we already have the coordinate for our occupation stations and on our back side station. But we'll be using it. So what we'll be using is angle and distances to carry out our measurements. So what we'll do is we'll go to the main menu, which is the startup page. The first thing we'll be doing is to take our measurements or take our backside measurements. So observe our backside station. When taking your measurements, try as much as possible to measure from the bottom end of the pole, the bottom tip of the pole, before rotating the telescope to the prism. So our first measurement is to our backside. We've backsighted the point, so what we'll do, we'll click on O set. It's asking us to zero set, so we'll click on yes. That will change the horizontal reading to zero zero zero. Although another method is if you have the the four bearing from the instrument station to the backside station, you can enter it on H set. So you just type in the forward bearing and you click on set. Thereby other measurements you'll be taking will be four bearing from the instrument station to the station. So but since we don't have it, we we'll use the zero set. So we'll go back and do the zero set. Now we'll click on zero set, click on yes. So our horizontal reading is zero zero. So we'll go to distance, click on distance, or we'll click on all. Then we'll measure to our backside station. So we've measured our backside station, the horizontal reading is zero. The distance is 4.675. So we've done our orientation. So the next thing we'll do now is to move the reflector to any point that we want to measure on site using the angle and distance method. So we've moved our reflector to a new station that we want to measure. So we we'll try as much as possible to back set from the, the bottom tip of the pole then we'll move the telescope to to the reflector before we we'll measure. So we we'll back set the points. Now we'll go to click on distance on the distance page. We'll click on all and we'll click on major. So once you click on OK, the data will be saved. So to take another station, make measurement to another station, you move your prism, then of course you rotate your instrument to the point to backset the point, and then we'll measure again for our station two. So by setting the points, now we want to measure again. So we'll click on all. Our point name, the point we are measuring to save on the total station is 006. We are using RAD for our code name, then we'll click on measure. So we we'll measure the point. The distance to that point is 9.413. The horizontal bearing in reference to our backside station is 26 degrees. So we'll click on OK to save. We'll move to another point you want to measure. So we are moving to the third point and the fourth measurement after the third measurement after taking our back side. So this is our third station. Bisect the point. 
and then we we'll click on O. We are measuring to 007 now. RLD is the our code. Height of reflector is 1.829. So we'll click on measure. So we've measured the points. This distance is 40 point. 156 we'll click on ok to save the points so now we've measured three points apart from our back site so to assess the data that we've measured we'll go to menu memory manage which is number three then we'll click on number one which is file maintain then we'll go to major file which is number one again then the job we worked on this coordinators so we select the job and it will open so we'll see all the data that we've measured so the three data the three these uh, points we measured on this total uh, on this total session now is down 005 006 and 007 so as you select the first point you cannot click on view you see the slope distance on the first page and the second page you click on p1 to access the second page then you see your resulta reading in reference to your backside station so for another point we measure which is 006 we click on view the distance is 9.413 and on the next page which is p1 the horizontal the horizontal angle is 26 degrees then for the last point we measured 007 click on view the distance is 40.156 then on the page 2 the horizontal angle is 154 42 minutes and 31 seconds so that is how to carry out measurements on using the angle and distance method on the Comnav C200 total station. So thank you very much and have a wonderful day.